Hello, this is Victor. In this video, I'm going to be walking you through the process of archiving your email or any other bookmarks or things like that you want to save from your Google account as you transition away from KIS or just want to back up for the summer. The first thing you're going to want to do is go to myaccount.google.com. Again, that's myaccount.google.com. What that will do is take you to this page. Uh, which is all of the information about your account with KIS. Um, when it asks you to sign in, make sure you sign in with your KIS account. And then I'm going to walk you into a process known as Google Takeout, uh, which allows you to download an archive of any information that you would like. And so once you're on this screen, go ahead and click the Control Your Content button from the middle menu. The first thing that's going to pop up is the ability to download and archive all of your data from Google products. So we're going to go ahead and create an archive. Now what this is going to do along the way is let us select all of the things that we want. So I'm going to go ahead and disable my Google Plus notifications. I don't really need my calendar. I would like to keep my contacts, my Google Drive, my Google Photos. I have no need of my Google Play books, so just continue going through this and making sure that you select all of the things that you would like to select um, while removing all of the things that you would like to remove. Um, and so you can select anything at all. For the mail, uh, what you're going to want to do is make sure that you either have your mail set to include everything or you do select labels of your email. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and just keep an archive of all of mine uh, and continue disabling all of the features as I go. So I only have a small number of things selected now. Um, and what I'm going to go ahead and do is hit next. What it will do is it will create a zip file of all of your data. That zip file will be 2 gigs or less and it will send all of that information to you in an email. So you can go ahead and hit Create Archive, like I'm about to do, and then just walk away from it, and that will send you an archive of all of your emails and any additional information that you selected. If you have any questions about creating an archive of your Google data, please feel free to reach out to any of the tech integrators or contact me directly. Thanks.